So the Tigers, we change sides of the field here. And the Jags from the Tiger 45, third and eight for them. They'll snap it, it's a pass. No, he's gonna be a keeper. A run, and another big run here by their quarterback. And here comes the Jags from the Tiger 29, first and 10. Snap it, first back through. Still on his feet, and he'll pick up about nine yards on the play. They'll hand it off again, a fumble, but he picks it up. Stays on his feet. Here comes the Capital Jags on another run, and not much there. Their own eight-yard line, the Jags in the red zone, looking for something. And he goes inside, and then he gets busted again, and forward progress might get... So here's the call. It's going to be a offsetting foul against the Jags. And the player ejected. So they've ejected a player and they'll back him up. And that's a big one. So now the Jags will face a second and way long. And so the clock will run. There's the snap, a fake. Going to be a big pass. It's completed. Still on his feet. And then he dances out of bounds. So I think they're forced to run it here. This is fourth down territory. And they do just that. They'll run it. And then he stays on his feet. Still on his feet. And then he goes out of bounds. And they'll turn it over on downs here as they don't manage to get a first down. So the Toss Tigers run another play here. They'll keep it on the ground, try to burn the clock. Tigers with the ball at their own 14, faced with a second in about six yards. And another penalty flag comes flying out and delay a game, Taos. 7.59 left in the ball game. And the Tigers will snap it. And then Molina goes down in a fumble. Oh, so Taos recovers, and it's a safety, apparently. So here comes the kick, Marmol. He with that great kick of his. He just kicks it nicely. Uh, received at the 35. Bounces off a couple of players, and then goes down at, or close. Well, it's at the 47 for the Jags. First and 10 on the Tiger, 47. Jags on the attack. Big snap, pitch out to the right side. On his feet, goes down out of bounds, and a penalty flag. Face mask, Towns Tigers. So the Jags hand it off. They'll run it to the right side, not much there. So the Jags again, second and eight for the Jags. Snap it, hand it off. Outside run, and then he goes out of bounds. Well, he stays inbound, so that clock will run. So first and goal for the Jags from the seven. Hand it off again, this time inside and an inside fumble. Uh, but the Capital Jags recover, and it's a touchdown, touchdown for, the Jags, for the Jags, apparently. apparently. So the Jags come up with a score here late in the game. And it's 16-10 now. Here it comes. Quick one. And it goes in for a two-point conversion. So the Jags score on the two-point conversion. Now 16-12, 6-29. Left in the fourth and final period. And they do. Nope. They go this side. And down goes the runner. So here comes the Tigers again, second and 16. They'll snap it, run it with Anthony LaBella. Anthony on his feet, first down for Anthony, he's gone! He's still on his feet. And then Anthony LaBella with a big run all the way down to the 30. There's the snap, the quick handoff to Pacheco. And still on his feet. And then he gets dropped. 
They hand it off again to Pacheco, and he gets brought down quickly. And this is pass all the way. Screen pass to the inside to Pacheco. And then Pacheco goes down, and he gets. Talavares will try to run it up the middle. Not much there for him. Under center, Molina. And he's going to pitch it out to Isaac Garcia. Gonzalez, I mean. He turns his field, and nothing there for Isaac. We're in it, and they just bounced out. 239 and ticking left in the game. Snap. Molina's going to go deep. There's the pass. It's caught, but not much there. And it goes to Anthony LaBella. And there's the snap. Molina's going to roll, throws it. And it's caught for a touchdown. Max Suazo for a TD. That was great. That was a good finish for the Tigers. And the ball's up and good for the extra point. So the Tigers will probably win this thing as they go up on top 23 to 12. And it's a two possession ball game for Capital and I think that's about does it here. And Marmol ready to kick it off. So this is a two-possession game for the Jags, and I don't think they have enough time, quite frankly. I could be wrong. Weirder things have happened, but this does not look good for the Jags, and it looks great for Taos. There's a runner still on his feet, and then he gets brought down about the 41-yard line. 136 left in the ball game. The Taos Tigers up on top, 23 to 12. And nothing there, and he gets dropped for a loss. And the Jags are going to want to pass here. And they do, and it's off the mark. And then a penalty flag. That's going to come back as Suazo has it in his hands. And Suazo will go out of bounds, but that is going to be a... That's going to come back. Apparently that was a pass interference call that'll go probably go against Taos on a pass interference call and a come back all the so way. So Capital will get a first down at the Tiger 40. 39 ticks left in the game. All the fans are up on their feet. And it's going to be a deep pass and that'll go deep. And that one's dropped. First and and here we go. Snap. As we mentioned, a big Hail Mary. And it's intercepted. That will be intercepted by Max Suazo. And then Max still on his feet. He's going to beat the pack. And then he gets tripped by his own man. He got tripped by his own man. And that's the end of the ball game. So the Taos Tigers will win this one on a final interception by Max Suazo. This one finishes. Taos Tigers 23, the Capital Jags 12. And we'll get a shot here of the scoreboard. And there it is, the final score, Taos 23, the Capital Jags 12. On behalf of Glenn Pike and myself, Rudy Baca, thank you for joining us here for TaosSports.com. Adios, everybody.